my last selfie video ever. So crazy. Here I am at the uh, hills, the mountains, just seeking the Lord. It's so beautiful out here. And you know, I'm just thinking, oh, by the way, I'm with Mia. Say hi, Mia. She's too distracted by how beautiful it is out here. <laughs> Anyways, uh, I just wanted to state that uh, this is my last video because I'm actually I'm getting off of everything. You know, I'm just tired of it. The, the matrix, you know what I mean? So what I'm trying to say is I'm done with phones. I'm done with, you know, computers and video cameras the whole thing. I'm just done with it. I just want to seek the Lord the way that it used to be before technology, before selfies. You know what I mean? I want to seek the Lord with all of my heart. I just want to live in His will, in His presence, in His wind, in His nature, in His love. His grace is for all people if you just hear truth. He desires mercy, not sacrifice. He, he never wanted war. He never wanted people killing people, man. He didn't the hard hearts and stiff necks of people but you know back in the day there was evil a lot of evil going on and today it's even more evil and you know what evil should be destroyed and it will be and right now the Holy Spirit is still here on earth and speaking truth through many of his disciples through many of his people truth is here now and I'm done with technology I'm telling you all this 3D panoramic video stuff, it's so cool. But I can't keep making videos, I can't keep with this technology, it's, it's the matrix. I wanna get out of it. I wanna be done with it. You know what I mean? I wanna be done with it. It's time to live in him. So you won't be seeing more videos from me. I've hit the end of my media road. I've hit the end of my social media road. I've hit the end of my uh, story on video and everything. I've told my story. It's my testimony. It's the truth of what I'm living in. The words of Jesus are true. He really was the Messiah. He is the Messiah. He still lives. He was raised again. Those that don't want to believe it, I'm sorry, but you are lost still because he was the one that God sent to speak to the world, to show us truth of his word, of what God's will truly is. And it's love. It's mercy instead of sacrifice, you guys. I'm not about my life anymore. I give it up. I'm not about my ways anymore. I'm about his ways. I wanna live in his ways. And yes, even if it takes getting off of all social media and apps and technology, cause I was lost in it, I'm telling you, it can just take over your life. But the more you focus on the Lord, the more you're led into all truth because his will can be done without technology. You don't even need it. All you need is him and a relationship with him. Spend time with him. Get out of the matrix. Much love to each and every one of you, by the way. Thank you so much for hearing my story, my testimony, as I live it. And I love you all. Come on, Mia. Let's keep enjoying this view, huh? Huh, Mia? Yeah, I can't have a pet lion, and, uh, you know, and a pet tiger here, so. I have a pet cat, and you know what? They're awesome, they're just like little tiggers. I love them. Just like I love you guys. All of God's nature, all of his creation. Forgive those who you, who you were upset at. Let people believe what they want. It's not our job to force them to believe. We just love them and tell them the truth. If they don't wanna hear, they can do their thing. They can serve in the way that they wanna serve. It's not about hatred, it's not about who's right or wrong. It's about God's word and truth and in light. And you guys can read his word. It's available. Anyways, I love you guys. I have retired the uh, DGPM, David G. Purpose music thing. I'm no longer about my name anymore. It's not about me, you guys. This is about God's will, his creation, his love. The truth that he's poured into my life is being like a fountain of water that's going to spring out to the world because I hear his word. And you can too. I'm not some special person, dude. I never was. And I know that I've cried with tears knowing that I'm just a person. I'm just a man. But his word is true and strong. He prophesied everything to prove that his word is true. God's word has always told what was going to happen and it happened. And it's still doing that to this day. 
His promises are everlasting. I'm so excited for everything God is doing in my life. I hope you are too. Much love.